Canada continues to be a top choice for those seeking a better quality of life, education, and work opportunities. In 2025, the Canadian government has refined its immigration targets, focusing on programs that support economic growth and strengthen smaller communities. These changes are designed to bring skilled professionals and their families to Canada through targeted pathways, especially through the economic and regional immigration programs. In this video, we'll explore Canada's updated immigration targets and explain how people worldwide can apply for permanent residency, PR, through specific pathways, focusing on eligibility, the application process, and family benefits. Before we dive into the details, please take a moment to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss critical Canadian immigration updates. If you know someone who could benefit from these insights, share this video with them. It could be exactly what they need to make an informed decision. All right, let's get started. Understanding Canada's Economic and Regional Immigration Programs Canada's economic and regional immigration programs invite skilled workers to areas that often lack labor. Through these programs, immigrants can apply to live and work in less populated regions, paving the way to PR for them and their families. The major immigration pathways include the Rural and Northern Immigration Pilot, RNIP, the Home Care Pilot, and the Francophone Immigration Pilot. Each of these programs has a specific focus and purpose in addressing Canada's needs. Canada hopes to boost local economies and help these communities thrive by encouraging immigration to these areas. Key Pathways for Regional Immigration Let's take a closer look at each program and its primary focus. Rural and Northern Immigration Pilot, RNIP The RNIP targets skilled individuals willing to work in rural and northern areas. It's community-driven, focusing on inviting skilled workers to towns that need labor in areas like healthcare, technology, and business. The goal is to bring newcomers into these communities to help them grow economically and address skill shortages. Francophone Immigration Pilot Canada's Francophone Immigration Pilot prioritizes attracting French-speaking immigrants willing to settle in communities outside Quebec. This program offers a great opportunity for Francophone applicants to build Francophone culture in areas where French is less commonly spoken, like Ontario, Alberta, and Manitoba. If you speak French, this program could fast-track your application and help connect you with communities that actively welcome French-speaking residents. Home Care Pilot This pathway focuses on healthcare professionals, particularly those skilled in elderly and disability care. Canada has recognized a critical shortage in home care professionals, and this pilot offers a way to apply for PR while bringing your family to Canada. Applicants in fields like nursing, support work, or healthcare have a strong chance of securing PR through this program. Eligibility Requirements and New Targets for 2025 Canada has set clear eligibility criteria and target numbers for these pathways in 2025. Here's what you need to know. Work Experience A minimum of one year of recent, relevant work experience is required to apply for PR through these pathways. Experience in high-demand sectors, such as healthcare, technology, and business, may further improve your chances. Language Proficiency most applicants need to demonstrate language proficiency in either English or French. Here's how it breaks down. 1. English speakers. The IELTS test is commonly used for English proficiency. 2. French speakers. French-speaking applicants, especially those applying for the Francophone immigration pilot, should complete the TEF, Test Evaluation de Francais, to showcase their language skills. Education. To be eligible, you'll need to have your foreign credentials assessed by a Canadian authority such as World Education Services, WES. Most programs require at least a high school diploma, though some pathways may require a higher level of education. Job Offer Requirement Each pathway, particularly RNIP and the Francophone Immigration Pilot, mandates that applicants secure a job offer from a participating employer in a designated community. Securing this job offer will be your first step in establishing eligibility. Applying for PR through the Rural and Northern Immigration Pilot, RNIP the RNIP is structured to address labor shortages in small towns and rural regions. Here's a detailed look at the steps involved. 1. Obtain a job offer. To begin, secure a job offer from a community employer participating in the RNIP program. This offer must align with your skills and the community's needs. 2. Meet community-specific requirements. Each community involved in RNIP has unique demands. You should research the community's requirements, including job types, language proficiency, and endorsement procedures. 3. Apply for a community recommendation. After securing your job offer, you'll need a recommendation from the community where you plan to work. This endorsement is crucial, as it confirms that your skills match the community's needs and that you're committed to settling there. 4. Benefits of RNIP. 
RNIP offers priority processing for PR applications in high-demand sectors, making it a popular choice for professionals in healthcare, technology, and business. It's an ideal pathway if you're looking to make a long-term impact on a rural community in Canada. Francophone Immigration Pilot – A Pathway for French-Speaking Immigrants The Francophone Immigration Pilot is an opportunity for French speakers to gain PR in Canada, particularly outside Quebec. Here's how it works. Eligibility Criteria 1. French Language Proficiency To qualify, applicants must demonstrate French proficiency through exams such as the TEF. French speakers from French-speaking nations, including Africa, India, and Pakistan, will find this pathway advantageous. 2. Job Offer Requirement Similar to RNIP, applicants need a job offer from a community within a participating Francophone immigration program. Application Process The Francophone Immigration Pilot requires applicants to 1. Select a community, research which communities outside Quebec participate in the Francophone program. 2. Demonstrate a willingness to settle. The application process involves showcasing your intent to settle in the Francophone community, which may be an advantage during processing. Home Care Program – PR Pathway for Healthcare Workers and Families To be eligible for the Home Care Program, applicants must have at least one year of recent experience in home care roles, such as caregiving or elderly care. They should also possess a high school diploma, although some roles may require higher qualifications depending on the specific position. Language proficiency is essential, and applicants need to achieve a minimum score on an English or French language test to qualify. Application Process 1. Secure a job offer. Applicants must obtain a job offer in a relevant healthcare role, typically as a caregiver. 2. Include family members. This program allows applicants to bring their spouses and children to Canada, providing a pathway to PR for the entire family. Step-by-step -step Application Process for Canada PR Follow these steps to apply for PR through one of Canada's regional or economic immigration programs. 1. Obtain regional approval. Once eligible, secure endorsement from a designated community before moving to the federal stage. 2. Submit federal application. Submit your federal PR application to IRCC after receiving community approval. 3. Complete medical and police checks. All family members must pass a medical exam and provide police certificates. 4. Submit required documents. These include educational assessments, language scores, work experience proofs, and community endorsements. 5. Approval and PR card issuance. If approved, you'll receive an immigration visa, and a PR card will follow once you arrive. Bringing your family to Canada, requirements and benefits. Eligible family members, such as spouses and children under 22, can accompany you to Canada. They'll need to complete medical exams and provide police certificates. Canada provides settlement services to assist families with housing, language classes, and job placement. Support services for new PR holders. After arriving in Canada, Puerto Rico holders gain access to social benefits such as health care, child benefits, and educational opportunities for children. Canada offers settlement services to help new PR holders integrate smoothly. In conclusion, with the 2025 targets and pathways in place, Canada has clear routes to PR for skilled immigrants. Whether through the RNIP, Francophone Immigration Pilot, or Home Care Program, there are ample ways to build a successful life in Canada. Meeting eligibility requirements and following the detailed steps can help you begin your journey to Canadian PR with confidence. That's all for today's video. To stay informed about Canadian immigration news, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and turn on notifications. If you know someone who might benefit from this information, share this video with them, they'll appreciate the insights. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.